Hello and welcome to Southern Shooters. My name's Stu. Today we're going to be looking at installing a bipod on your rifle. The type of bipod that we're going to be installing is a Harris style bipod, a very common bipod. These Harris style bipods attach to the front sling stud on your rifle. If you don't have a sling stud, you can get one installed by a gunsmith or do it yourself. But before we go any further, safety first. The way I'm going to make in, ensure that my rifle is safe is I'm going to remove the bolt, check the floor plate, do a visual inspection of the chamber, and we're good to go. Now we're going to look at the bipod that we're installing and how to install it. So for demonstration purposes, I'm going to open the arm up and loosen the tension screw back so it's flat with this bracket. Then I'm going to grab the scissor action and opening it up so the two pins are wider than the sling stud. Then go to my rifle, opening the, opening the scissor action, putting the two pins into the sling stud and it should just sit there. I'll slowly, slowly start doing up the tension screw and this will bring the bipod up to the rifle. As I'm doing so, I'll make sure that it's square and straight with the rifle. Now that it's finger tight, you've got a few different options. If you're in the field, you might want to leave it finger tight, but you just want to make sure that during the day that it stays tight. Depending on the make and model, you might want a pair of pliers, an Allen key or a screwdriver, and you want to do it up quarter to half a turn. But you don't want to over tighten it as you may damage the rifle. This particular bipod, you can actually attach your sling back to another sling stud on the back of the bipod. There we have it, bipod attached, ready to go. Have fun.